Let's teach some math, Sonny Liston. Hey, it's me, Steph Curry, with the Golden State Warriors and TarverAcademy.com. And I'm here to teach you about some exterior angles of a triangle. What? Can that even happen? How do we work it? Okay, let's do an example problem. Okay, here we go. All right. So we're looking at this example problem right here. We want to find X. X is right here. And don't be like, <laughs> draw a line to it. That's silly. I want you to find the measure of X using this information. I'm going to pause it, let you work it, and then I'm going to show you how to work the problem. Ready? Pause. We good? Okay. So now let's figure out how to work this. Whenever you look at this problem, um, we know X is right here. We know we got these two little guys, and then we got this little angle right here. Here is the explanation, then I'll give you just the simple facts of it. We know the interior angles of a triangle always equal 180 degrees, correct? Yeah. We know that a straight line, those two angles put together always equal, that's right, 180 degrees. So what that tells us is that if we take, say we just look at this triangle, okay, we could figure out what this angle is, correct? So we just take 180, subtract 72 from it, which is 108, and then subtract 45 from it, which is, it's easy, 63, that's right. Okay, sorry, I like to check myself because I don't want to look back at this video and have to delete it. So 63 degrees. So we know this is 63 degrees, correct? Yeah. Well, then we could ignore this and just look at this. We know that right here, these two equal 180 when they're added together. Okay? And so whenever you work that, you could just be like, oh, okay, well, if X plus 63 equals 180, I could just solve for X. Subtract 63 from both sides. It goes away. X equals 117. Boom. You're done. We found X degrees. Now, there is a shorter way that I want to show you a little shortcut on. The rule here, you're essentially subtracting, like if I take 63 and I subtract it from 180, I know that I'm going to be left with the sum of these two little guys, which is going to be 117. So as a shortcut, you don't have to find this angle. Anytime you have an exterior angle of a triangle, it is always going to be equal to these two angles, a non-adjacent angles, added together. Okay? So when if I just added those two together, I got 117. That would have been X. It's always going to be equal because you're taking out the same thing from this 180 and this 180. So these two are going to be equal. That's it. Thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Steph Curry, my name, by the way. Don't get confused. And if you could, that'd be great if you would go to... Nope, not that. Boom! TarverAcademy.com. Check it out. Give a subscribe. Tell your friends. Peace.